Harmony, do you eat all the Joppa cakes again? Every time. Let's go. Angels, immediate launch. Finally. Enemy aircraft approaching. Welcome. I'll be reacting to new Captain Scarlet, Season 1, Episode 10. These clips are provided for commentary purposes only. It is not a market substitute. Please support the original. And no spoilers in the comments. Yes, Mr. Ons, I'm talking to you too. It has now been three weeks oh. since our last contact with the Mars base. There could be a major communications problem, but I don't have to tell you my greater fear. Mm -hmm. Yes, my greater fear is that Lieutenant Ellis is in danger. Detaching from main body. Three, two, one. Oh. Hmm. We're illuminated. We're under attack. Oof. Not a hospitable place to crash in. They're not getting back into orbit anytime soon. Ah! Whew. Welcome to Mars. It'll take two weeks for another rescue mission to get here. We don't have that much oxygen. So we take back what's ours. <laughs> well, if it's named Elysium, maybe you could ask Hades for some help. Are you okay, Paul? I'm fine. It's the first time you've been here since Adam, I'm fine. Oh right, this oh. is. I do miss the gentle hopping. Oh. Did not live up to its name. What was it at Elysium they were running away from? Hmm. I do like these armor suits. What a mess. Keep looking, Doc. We need to know what we're up against. Forensic medicine isn't one of my specializations, but uh, I'll do what I can. Oh, uh, friend! Blue, can you not? Sorry. Give me a heart attack. What about communications? Fried. The people here were trapped and then slaughtered. Yeah. Yikes. What in the Scorpion King is that? We're gonna need bigger explosives for that. That was a Spectrum Loco. This used to be a spectrum device. It's a probe the scientists used for work in hostile environments. Built of titanium armor plating, this thing can climb inside a volcano and dig out rock samples. Highly articulated, it's got a cable gun to help it climb, pulse lasers, and a diamond tipped saw. And how many of these rats are there? I might be able to get the base shuttle flying. There's a diagnostic unit on the bird we came in on. Systems. Airlock number two just let somebody or something into the base. Great. That's just great. You better get going. I was planning to use you as bait. Oh, nice. <laughs> Did you hear that voice? Ah. <gasps> That's a hard no for me. Oh, remember, I'm not indestructible. Okay, we got one down. How many more? There's another one. It's after Destiny. It's gone after Destiny. Get your helmet on. Alright. Except, didn't they say earlier it was designed to go inside volcanoes? 
So I think the rat is still down there. Mm hmm. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> Need a hand. <laughs> Main thrusters ready to fire. Good. Then let's get off this rock. I'm glad we got some closure on what was left of Spectrum on Mars. As tragic as it is, at least now they know what happened and that Elysium is officially closed for business. Personally, I'm not a huge fan of the space stuff. It's a nice change of pace, but I'm really team T in the Midlands. I did really like their spacesuits though. I think out of all the new Captain Scarlet outfits so far, if I was going to pick one to cosplay, it would be this one. As long as it's not a warm day. <laughs> they also had some really good teamwork going on in this episode. It was fun seeing Dr. Gold getting to have an away mission and also being honest about his capabilities. That moment when Scarlet was like, okay, we have to figure out what killed them and can you do autopsies? And he's like, I mean, I can. I'm not a forensics person though, just a heads up on that. And I appreciate that he was honest about it and wasn't like, yeah, you got it, Scarlet. I can totally do this. So my estimation of Dr. Gold really went up there. I think it's important in a professional setting to be very clear about what you're good at and what you're not good at is that's partly how you figure out your team. So I have a lot of respect for people who are very sure about what they can and cannot do. And if they can't do it, speaking up and being like, I'm gonna do my best, but just know that. And maybe we wanna find someone better, if they're available. In this case, of course, they were not, because it was a two week rescue mission to come to Mars. But the fact that he was able to speak up is really proof of how positive a work environment Spectrum is. And I love that. Captain Scarlet, you are virtually indestructible. Scarlet, the indestructible man. Do, do.